Hi, I'm Rasmus Lauritsen. I am Head of Fisheries Research here for Game Wildlife uh, Conservation Trust here at East Stoke. And today we are here to talk about a couple of fish that's been detected, adult salmon coming back to the river. Uh, these adult salmon uh, stem from a cohort, very small cohort of little salmon leaving the river in 2017. We first became aware that we had very few uh, uh, young salmon in the river uh, in 2016 during our par tagging survey. When we uh, pit tag uh, juveniles that allows us not just to detect fish but to de detect the individuals. So we'll know exactly when they were born, where we tagged them, when they left the river uh, and when they return. And unfortunately when we came to actually counting and uh, the estimating the number of fish leaving the river the following year the, the picture was basically that the annual, the sort of 10 year average of smolts leaving the river Froom uh, is just around 10,000 and in, uh, in 2017 it was less than 4,500 fish so, so below 50% of our 10 year average. Uh, we've never in the 15 years that we've been monitoring smolts leaving the river seen numbers anywhere that small. On the chalk streams here in the south of England, the salmon, young juvenile salmon in the river grow very fast. They're very productive rivers. So more than 97% of our salmon leave the river as smolts as only one year old, whereas in the majority of other rivers in the UK, they'll be either two or three years old. So we, in principle, get an early warning of what the smolt run uh, looks like in other rivers uh, potentially a year later. We were, of course, uh, last year in 2018, we were worried about how many one sea winter or grills, as some anglers call them, uh, fish was going to return to the river. And as predicted due to the poor smolt run in 17, there were very few grills returning to uh, the river Froome in 2018. This uh, picture of poor return rates from the 2017 smolt uh, cohort, unfortunately, is carrying on here in 2019 where they are due to return as two sea winter fish. Uh, thus far here by middle of June, we've detected four such pit tag fish return, uh, which compares to a dozen fish in the two previous years. The returning salmon that, uh, that we're, we're looking at on the video, well, we, we tagged that here just below Hurst Bridge on the 2nd of September in 2016. And at that time it was 100 millimeters long and weighed 11.8 grams. This individual we detected when he was on his way to sea six months later, three kilometers upstream of East Stoke here at Binden, and then again down here at East Stoke on his way out. This individual then continued to spend two years at sea before returning to the river, and we actually captured this individual on the video, as you see, and from the video we've been able to estimate that it has grown to a size of 82 centimeters whilst at sea. It's reassuring that uh, our monitoring activities allows us to sort of predict what the runs might be like in the years to come but of course it's, uh, it's, it's, it's with a heavy heart that we see so few uh, salmon, uh, two seaweed into salmon return to the river this year. The year is not over so it might just be of course the summer that more of these fish return later in the year than normal this year but unfortunately that might not come true.